Two men are on trial, accused of plotting to kill singer Joss Stone and cut off her head. The men allegedly planned to dump her body in a river. Police say that when they arrested these men, they had a samurai sword, a hammer, knives, gloves, and black bags, and that the suspects had notes in their car mapping out the whole plot. Showbiz Tonight is in London tonight with CNN international correspondent Max Foster. Now, Max, these two men were reportedly angry because of Joss Stone's connection to the royal family, including the fact that she attended Prince William's wedding. What's that all about? Well, that's right. I mean, she is friends with William and Harry. She did go to the wedding, and this came up in court. There are these notes that they've discovered, basically, handwritten notes by the accused. And the prosecution uh, said about one of them that these documents appear to express disapproval of the royal family. Uh, he said that Joss Stone associates with members of the royal family. Her concerts have been attended by members of that family, and she was invited to the royal wedding at the end of April that year. Hence the Crown, the prosecution, say uh, she she was a target. So they think that plays into this, but there also seems to be a motive of possibly um, financial reasons as well, because they are charged with a robbery as well as uh, murder. How life-changing something like this has to be for Josh. She just testified at the trial. She talked about how she used to not even lock the doors at her house in Devon. That's how safe she felt, Max. I have to imagine that has changed in a major way. Absolutely. Well, Devon is a rural area. It's very pretty, very safe, got a very low crime record. Uh, uh, the accused are accused of coming all the way down from Manchester, which is more than 200 miles away. But, yeah, she said she never put her alarm on, never locked the door. She obviously does now. She also talked a bit about this uh, uh, evidence that was presented that the uh, accused um, watched a TV programme on MTV, Cribs, you might know it, uh, showing celebrities around their houses. They said they saw her showing... Uh, the crew around her house and she brought this up saying actually they got this a bit wrong because it was her previous house that was shown on that show so they got that a bit wrong. Well I mean it is just a scary scary situation for a, a really terrific young artist who is very well liked CNN international correspondent Max Foster. Thank you so much Max.